Bismillah, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, here we now uh, study about the park building. Yes. Uh, in the previous session, we already study about the the geometry. Yes, whether this cursor, this is beam. Yes and also plate yes the geometry of the plate uh, and then in the next next session we also uh, have studied about the loading yes the loading and their combinations of the loading which is the dead load life load earthquake load uh, on the X and Z direction and wind load on the put direction and rain load and all of the combination. Uh, now we should study the post processing, which is the the result. Yeah, how to control or to analyze the result of the uh, particular parking building. Here, for example, we select S yes, parallel to Y. This is the column selection. Yes. Uh, before anything happen, first and foremost, we have to preview the 3D rendering of the of the building. Yes. And we want to uh, view in the in the cover yes because in, uh, as the project uh, will be done yes we have to describe all in the report for example this picture yes we have to crop uh shut uh this step yes thing is the same or you can also view the the bottom view yeah of that building for example this yes Yes. In order to make clear the the art, yes. Because every design have eight arts. So we can fulfill the the requirement of the of the user which is the one of them is the the art of the reporting okay so this is parking building span of 20 meters and flow chart yes and coordinate you have to uh, make the coordinate, yes. For example, coordinate. Okay. And send to pack. Okay. Geometry coordinate of yes of the parking building. 
So you have uh, only several, yes. Only several. For example, this, yes. And this, okay. Which is 20. Yes. 20 meters. And 20 meter also. Okay. And vice versa in the y direction. This is twenty. And twenty also. Okay, this is the geometry of the building, yes, the building. Okay, and then this is five, yes, uh, four, yeah, four. Okay, I think it's all. You can uh, select object maybe. Okay. Okay, this is 3D geometry. Uh, and we go to the reinforced concrete, yes. For example, this is the axial, yes. Axial uh, condition, yes. Axial control. Okay. Okay, for example, the building is Design of parking building. Okay. This is the column K1. Yes, this is the engineer. This is the structure. Okay, this engineer. Part, okay, reinforcement, okay, okay, uh, in this, in this analytical modeling, yes, for example, we select, yes, parallel to Y, yes, and then we, uh, First and foremost, we have to run. Yes, run the analysis. Uh, please make it sure that the column is already set, supported by a fix. Yeah, fix support. Okay.
okay if done you can click the the button yeah done and you can for example view only selected object only yes you can find the uh, the result yes by clicking post processing and for example in the combination one eight yes one is equal to eight for example the fx yes you can adjust the scale adjustment so you have to enlarge this value okay into something larger okay this is the axial so this compression yeah less compression and the the lesser compression okay uh how much yeah it's force in the axial you can click the report and click the beam and forces axial forces absolute values loading and then you only choose the load combination yes the load combination and please bring to the uh, right side so the beam four under load condition of nine yes load condition of nine yes have the certain value of axial and the moment was zero yes not here uh, at the maximum axial forces the moment was zero for example we click the yes we click the mz yeah mz and we adjust the scale for example for z this is a zero because all the all the the load is in the circumstances so the middle column is set to zero and vice versa in the my this uh this line is zero also so the reinforcement should be in the front and the back yes because uh the direction of the flexural loading is uh z uh, plus into z minus and for mz yes uh in the right yes and left so the the reinforcement should be in the x plus and the behind in the x minus okay i think it's all okay uh at the beam four yeah at the beam four so at the column yes number four okay this is a uh, due to yes due to the fx yes due to the fx which is the axial dominant yes we try to input the result yes uh 20 uh 24 point six uh mega newton or 24 hundred yeah kilo newton okay so we input 24 uh, for example this okay uh so the value is is wrong you can uh, add the value 24 uh and then 24000 and 600 yes 24600 kilonewton and the, all the moment yes which is the m z moment or m y moment is all zero in this position okay so you can click zero yes uh all the column calculation procedure 
uh, already mentioned, already described in the previous video. You can you can refer to to that. Okay. And then, uh, for example, in in this, yes, uh, we click the PIM4. This is in the this position, yes. And if you click, yes, the cursor and the the dimension of the column was one point four uh, times one point four meters. Okay, you can input uh, one thousand and four hundred. Yes, this is the concrete cover. Okay, so we we notify yes that the equation yes the equation of P n yes of P n for the case yes for the case. Uh, the filer, yes, the filer of the steel, yes, in the compression uh, region, yes, filer of the steel in the compressive region, okay. So if yes, I already uh, described uh, in the column yes video. This is the if the PU yes offer bigger offer the CPN should be yes bigger. It means the the PNP, yeah, PN balance is less than, yes, less than or more than, this is more than PU, this is the tension control, yes. It means the PU, yes, the axial load, the existing axial load is uh, less than PN, CPN. So this is tension. If the PU is bigger or larger than, than CPNP, and then uh, axial compressive control. Okay. Okay. Uh, tension control means the moment is dominant, and compressive control means the axial is dominant. You can click here and merge. Maybe uh, this. Okay, I think enough. Okay, and then this is the the value. Yes, we already mentioned about this. How was the uh, reinforcement? Okay. Okay, use the reinforcement, yes, uh, is consist in the four side, okay, in the four side, A, B, C, D, okay. Uh, if the, the only A, S, yes, the only the only AS action, yeah, AS, AS uh, prime, yes. We try AS uh, one and we try AS prime. Yes, this compression control, yes. Uh, actually, the, the position, yeah, is uh, very safe, yes, very safe. Maybe you can you can reduce, yes, you can reduce, for example, uh, this, 
Okay. This very safe. Yes. Very safe. And this still okay. Yes, still okay. And if you reduce, yes, if you reduce in uh, one meters only, also, yes, the dimension is also okay, yes, because the CPN is uh, larger than uh, the required uh, PU, okay? This tie up, yes, this tie up. Okay, distance of the stire. Okay. Uh, we no need to no need to talk about uh shear in the in the first time, but you have to mention yes, this is I already mentioned uh in the in the spirit video okay, so for example this is the four as yes. For AS, yes. For AS per, yes, P times uh, the diameter uh, square. Okay. And then we round up. Yes. We round up. Comma zero. Okay, this is the four. So we can uh, arrange, for example, for uh, twenty-two diameter, we require uh, six, uh, seven. I'm sorry, seven. Yes, and uh, all the re requirement of reinforcement is seven times four because there is uh, four side. Yes, there is four for side. I think it's clear. This is okay. So uh, at this stage, yes, at the stage, twenty six hundred uh, millimeters a square is adequate to hold the compressive load. Okay. Uh, this is the. Axial dominant, yes. Uh, now we go to the uh, we go to the moment, yes, moment. Uh, for example, yes. Uh, we click select uh, parallel to Y, yes, and we hide. Uh, I'm sorry. Now we unhide, yes. The result, for example. Okay. Uh, maybe the node, yes, maybe the node. We have to click the node. Okay. For example, you want to crop, yes, in, in your report, yes, you click, yes, you click and you. Uh, Please uh, only highlight your aforementioned uh, column. Yes, the particular column. For example, in the first, uh, in the first floor. Yes, in the first floor, you can click. Yes, select cursor, beam cursor. Okay. Okay. How about the other? Uh, yeah, the output, for example, click post processing, yes. And we click the result, yes, of MY, yes, MY or M MZ, yes, MY or MZ. You can click support, 
uh, report and BIM enforce. You click uh, absolute values means the the larger in the top, whether this is minus or plus. Okay, and then we click uh, loading. We click all the uh, combination. Okay. Uh, okay. We click. Okay. Uh, we we repeat again. Beam and force. Moment Z. Absolute forces. Loading. On the select the uh, combination. And this is the beam. Yes. The beam, which is the have the the largest moment, yes, the largest moment. Okay, you can click the. Uh, for example, we assume this is the. This is a uh, compressive, yes, compressive. I think. Axial but compressive, yes. Compressive control, and this is the moment control or tension, yeah. Tension, yes, control. For example, in the tension control, yes, uh, we copy this data, okay. Okay, we copy this data, okay. Yes, at the column. Yes, this is at, yes. Click. Okay, at the column 150, choose the MX, yeah, M -M -M -Z, yeah. Uh, moment dominant, yes, this is the moment dominant okay you can input yes input the moment of z yes which is the uh, 13 yes 13 thousand kilo newton meters okay you can input 30 thousand yes Uh, yes, 30,000 uh, moment, okay, okay, 30, okay, okay, 30,000. Okay, at the where is the axial? Yes, axial force is in the load condition of 15. Yes, load condition of 15. Okay, 10. Yes, 10,000 and Three hundred, yes, ten thousand and three hundred. Okay, okay, the uh, moment Z, yes, moment Z, no problem, I think. This gonna gonna check in the uh. Biaxial pending, yes, procedure. Okay. Now we see, yes, that the tension control is not okay. Yes. The tension control is not okay. Yes. Uh, Okay, this copy. 
the English translation. So this is the Whitney equation, yes. For a case failure in the tension region. Okay. Okay, use. Okay, now we, uh, now we try, yes, try an error, which is the AS one that uh, bring the okay. Okay, this is not okay. Uh, Okay, this is not okay also. Mm. Okay, <clears throat> uh, after we search, yes this position uh, which is the position of beam yes yes beam beam list yes select yeah list one hundred and fifty this is now we Go to the post processing, the report. Yes, uh, beam and force of the particular uh, column, moment Z, absolute. And then you have to choose in the uh, combination only. And yes, you have uh, 30, yes, say 30,000 kilometer meters and you input this and uh, you can click yes you can input the appropriate uh, dimension okay and this is uh, okay yes in the in the compressive control yes in the compressive control uh, tension control yes now okay this is the right right equation for the uh, particular part yes and this part the compressive is a uh, different uh, different Whitney equation for the column okay and then uh, if you if you give only for for example, 8,000, it is not okay. Yes, it is not adequate. So you give uh, 1,000, 10,000, and this is not okay. And you give uh, 11,000. Okay, and this okay. So, okay, uh, it is not, uh, not adequate, yes. Then this is okay, adequate, okay. Okay, uh, and we need, yes, Four times, yes, four times, times four, uh, for every single AS. So this is AS, yes, this AS, this is AS, uh, 
uh, prime. Yes, this is as prime for compression. So the this as this as uh, prime. This as this is as prime. Yes, and vice versa. If the moment is uh, is uh, coming into uh, opposite direction, okay. I think it's enough. Yes, this is the okay. Yeah, okay, adequate. Uh, and then uh, for for the sake of simplicity, you can you can input also. Yes, for the compressive control, the same direct. Uh, the same. Uh, the same dimension, although in the previous dimension is all okay. Uh, if you have yes, compressive uh, case, yes, it, it is okay, but in the moment, yes, uh, moment dominant, which is a tension control, is it is it is not okay with the 1000 uh, millimeter of dimension, yes, so the column dimension should be added. Uh, should be increased to fulfill the requirement. Uh, also, the the com the reinforcement is adequate. Yes, for compressive uh, uh, and not adequate for tension. So you have to add it to increase the reinforcement of tension reinforcement, which is the uh, eleven thousand. So in the 11,000, yes, okay, yes, so uh, there is 14, yes, 14, uh, 32, yes, there is 14, and you can uh, include in the summary, yes, in the summary, it is the Fifty six, yes, fifty six. Uh, okay, fourteen, yes. It's fourteen. Uh, you you have to you have to insert your cat, yes, because the the amount of the reinforcement part is not the same. Okay, I think enough. This for the K1, which is the moment dominant or tension dominant, uh, compression dominant. Yes, we should uh, give the same, the same dimension in order to not confusing the workers. Okay. Uh, next, yeah. Next in the in the second answer floor, yes. So you have to click uh, select cursor, beam cursor, yes. Okay. Okay. Now we click the result, the report, the beam and force, axial forces, absolute values, loading. Please click only the combination and the axial forces, the maximum axial forces is 15,400. Yes, for uh, 557. So you please, yes, please try uh, column uh, 557. Number five seven, uh, two to the F FX, yes. Axial compression dominant, okay. Okay.
column, yes. K2, yes. Uh, part reinforcement. Okay. And then, yes. Mr. X, yeah. Mr. X. Yes, Mr. X. Okay. And then we have the maximum, yes. Maximum for a column in the floor two and three is this one. Yes. Also, you, you have to click, yes. You have to click this. Uh, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. And please crop. Yes. And please crop. Please place here. Okay. I'll already place here. Okay. You crop. Shots I done. Okay. And then uh, you input, yes, you input the maximum, yes, uh, the maximum. Uh, sorry. So click the result, report. Uh, okay, in order to, to not Confuse, we click on the selected object. Yes. And we click result and report beam and forces. Okay, axial forces, absolute values. Loading only combination. And here's the uh, 15, yes. And 500. And five hundred. Okay, kilo newton. Okay, I think it's enough. And uh, hanjur tekan is same with the compressive control. Yes, compressive control because the axial is dominant. Okay. Okay. Equation with the equation. Okay. Okay. And then we find, yes, uh, the value is, is uh, far, yes. The, the CPN is larger over, over and over uh, the PU, yes. Okay. And then you may also decrease, yes, if compression control, yes. For example, this also, also little, yes, little. And then we go to the tension control. So the first and second, second, yes. The first, no, the second and the third uh, story, yes, is okay for for this column to uh, to use with one thousand and and four hundred millimeters, yes, one hundred and four uh, thousand millimeter. Although. Uh, Less, yes, I'll do less. It is also okay, I think. So for, for compressive control, it is still okay. Uh, you can reduce, yes. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, 1,000, 1,000 is still okay, yes. You can reduce. For example, this, 
Yes. I think it is also still okay. Yes, still okay. But in the tension, we should uh we should check, yeah. We should check, okay. Okay, column, okay. And the uh, part reinforcement. Okay. Add the column. Yes, we copy from this, yes. Yes, add the column two to the MZ. Yes, MZ. Moment dominant. Yes, so fractional dominant. And you can click. Yes, you can click and report. Yes, you can close this result. Report this. Uh, particular moment Z or moment Y, yeah, absolute values and loading. Okay. Okay. This is the, the beam 11, yes, 11 and 92. So the beam is Different, yes, different for K2 and K3. 11, 92. Okay. The moment is 8473. Okay, at four seventy three, and the PU, which is the axial force, is twenty five thousand uh, hundred. Yes, twenty six. Yes, twenty six hundred. Twenty six hundred. Twenty. Okay, thing is not okay, and this not okay, yes, and this not okay. You should, uh, you should give more, uh, more reinforcement. Okay, for example, eighty. It's not okay. not okay it is okay uh, in the 10 yes so it almost the same yes but uh we should differ, yes, we should differ the uh, the value to have more uh, knowledge, yes, to have more understanding. Okay, so equation PN, yes. The tension region, okay. And then you have to reduce, yes, one. Uh, for example, okay.
Okay, I think it's uh okay. So uh in the next yes, in the next problem, this is the MZ. You can change into the MY, yes, no problem. MY, MZ. On the each uh, stage, on the each case, you can uh, conclude. Okay, for example, yes, we we make it difference uh, to have more better understanding uh, what is actually happen in the particular column. Okay. And this is need, yes, the tension is need to be more, yes, it tends a less, yeah, less, I mean. So for example, this is 29 and 40. 64, yes. I mean, this is the last, yes. But in order to to make uh, them differ, yes. Okay, yes. The same, yes. The same, uh, the same dimension. Because if you reduce, yes. If you reduce the dimension, for example, this and this, I don't know, it is okay or not. It's not okay, yes? It is not okay. Uh, you didn't allow to, to make uh, the column A smaller. Okay. I think uh, it's very clear for the column. So if you have uh, the different yes width and depth of the column, for example, four hundred and seven hundred, you have to control twice. So all all you have to do is control third. Basically, first in the axial yes. Uh, whatever the moment MZ or MX, MY, you can abandon this. And the second, uh, the largest moment of MZ, uh, whatever the value of the P, and the third is the value of the largest MY, yes, whatever the axial P. And so you have. Uh, third, yes, you have the condition for the column, yes. Okay. Because the the moment in the third floor is much larger than the one those in the uh, first floor, yes. Okay, for example, we click, yes, selected object. And we we click parallel to Y and click the selected object. For example, we FX, yes, FX. The in the base, yes, in the base, the the value of the FX axial is bigger, but in the MZ, yes, for example, scale. Okay, two less. Okay. This value, yes, and this value, uh, the outer, the outer column, the outer column is uh, 
uh, have bigger moment than the interior column. Yes, but uh, in the axial, yes, the interior column have bigger bigger compression axial load than the exterior column, but have the less yes have the less moment yes have the less moment mm, this is uh, not clear okay have the less column then the exterior column yes i think it is enough for for you to uh, learn how to determine the column dimension to control in the particular particular dimension in the particular uh, direction and the particular uh, dominant compression or moment dominant which is the compressive control and tension control respectively Oke, okay, thank you for watching. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.